The end of a day at camp has turned tragic for a bus driver and a group of kids on his bus. Nassau police telling me that at about 3.20 this afternoon, a cement truck hit that mini school bus head on here in Locust Valley. The school bus was from the Locust Valley School District. The driver of the bus was killed in that accident. Uh, four children on the bus were injured. Three of them were six-year-old boys. The fourth was a nine-year-old boy. A bus matron who was also on board was also injured. She's identified only as a 64-year-old woman. The extent of their injuries is not known at this hour. We're told that all were rushed to area hospitals. The driver of the cement truck was also injured. According to police, he lost control of his truck when he was trying to pass under a train trestle. The driver of the truck apparently did not know his truck would not fit under the overpass. The truck was in collision, dislodging the cement truck barrel and causing the driver to lose control. At the same time, a school bus from the Locust Valley Central School District is traveling northbound on, on Oyster Bay Road and was in collision, a head-on collision with that truck. Nassau police are continuing their investigation at this hour. They can't say whether speed or anything else contributed to this tragedy. We're told that the school bus was returning from the Bayville Day Camp. Again, a school bus driver is dead, two other adults injured, as well as four children. The extent of their injuries not yet known. We're in Locust Valley. Greg Sergal, New York Nightly News.